Hi YouTube, I am back with a quick reading. I'm not going to try to pinpoint if this is new, old, whoever is on your mind, whatever comes up. If it seems like it really is old and you don't want to know about their old, um, then please check your other placements. Okay, but hopefully I found a deck that is can be both. Okay, so let's see. Let's see the person on your mind here. Also, since it's a quick reading, you always want to check out your other placements because those might be stronger energies um, and you might get your insight in there, okay? Let's see. Aries, the person on Aries' is mind. Self-reflective. trustworthy wow they passed the vibe check let's see give me more for aries self-reflective give me more so this person is has gone within see look at that four of swords has gone within they might be on a break or something they might be stepping back yeah they've been on a temporary break of relationships i feel like i don't know if you're on a break with them but they are just reviewing i feel like they're reviewing their life here for with the wheel of fortune let's see give me more of this trustworthy oh interesting okay so they're trying to heal they're trying to have patience they are trustworthy a little too much because i feel like this person has actually been hurt a lot and i feel like you have been hurt a lot and i feel like this person is actually um willing to really i want to say compromise interesting but willing to really like meet you halfway. but you might be a little bit uh like you're not really going to trust this person i don't know why but i feel like this is your energy it's fire but seems as if this person too has gone through some stuff but i feel like they or if you really do talk to this person they know that you've gone through so much and you can't trust so easily okay oh i don't know why i keep yeah queen of cups interesting so really give yourself some self-love maybe it's time to really reflect Aries, if this is you, I don't know why I'm getting that this might be you. You're going through some kind of um, healing phase too. This person is too, but I feel like this person is a lot more willing than you are <laughs> to kind of meet halfway. Okay, I don't know who this is, but do some self-care, self-healing. Use your intuition with this person, but I feel like they've been alone reflecting and things are going to turn around. I feel like this person has wanting wanting to probably turn their life around. It could be an air sign or another fire sign. It could be a Sag. Um, or it doesn't even matter what sign the wheel is there. Okay, I feel like things are going to turn around in your life. Okay, sorry about that. I need a two check on something let's see for taurus the person on taurus's mind what do we have here again i'm not gonna pinpoint if this is new or old i'm gonna try not to loves all you loves all of you even your flaws Ooh. let's see Sherry, common vision for the future. Wow, who are you talking to, Taurus? There is someone here. And then we have affection at the bottom of the deck. Um, so this person, they passed the vibe check, if you ask me. Let's see, what is this? Loves, loves all of you. They love your flaws. They love you. Mm. Wow, uh, with the temperance, yeah. This person is willing to really meet you have ways, uh, manifest something together, work together, compromise, meet you have ways. Okay, this person could be willing to invest 
in a relationship with you here okay i feel like you finally are getting the fruits of your labor hmm. give me more of this share a common vision for the future wow yeah you both want the same thing taurus i don't like this card though give me more of this king of pentacles this person loves a good life let's see okay so i feel like this person is also whoever i'm picking up on you both have share a common future but it kind of seems like this if you already know this person they're trying to leave their old self behind they're trying to um leave some kind of emotional baggage where i feel like it's more of their old self because i feel like this king of pentacles in this deck they have a cake and i always feel like this is a the king that likes their cake and eat it too so it seems as if they're trying to leave something behind because now they they want something real okay and it kind of seems like they are trying to leave they're trying to leave their old self behind that's what i'm getting here some of you you're trying to leave your old self behind and really invest on someone that really loves everything about you or you're trying to manifest someone here too but of course this is we're checking their vibe and that's what i'm mainly getting okay somebody here is actually gonna be willing to manifest something with you something strong something very they're gonna be very invested but they're trying to leave something behind okay you both share a common vision for the future two of swords somebody might be suppressing their emotions or trying not to um let anybody in so i don't know if that's you taurus so there is some kind of blockage here okay so or maybe you're trying uh, to maybe take a step back and see if maybe this is for real maybe it's too good to be true for you i don't know i'm kind of getting that feeling too okay so we have water we have um earth we have sag okay so let's keep going gemini's what do we have for gemini's the person on Gemini's mind. Let's see. The person on Gemini's mind. Friend zone. Ooh, Gemini, did you friend zone someone? Or someone's in the friend zone. <laughs> patience. Someone's trying to have patience with you, Gemini. What? <laughs> could be a fire sign i just saw it but um if they're not they have really strong fire sign in their chart why because the seventh house is sagittarius so let's see what is this friend zone they're trying to have patience okay somebody here got friend zoned because maybe they there were disappointment or they disappointed you hmm. yeah now they're trying to release some kind of disappointment i don't know if they're waiting for you to release some kind of disappointment um i don't know so they're thinking about the situation on a different in a in a different perspective give me more of this patience yeah they're trying to have patience here they're going within gemini um they're trying to have patience right now reflecting thinking about maybe the future here too trying to have patience on maybe um i don't know but i i this person really I don't know if you friend zone them or they're trying to get over some kind of disappointment they're trying to release that but right now there is some kind of like stuck energy not stuck but i feel like there's just some some quiet energy that is gonna 
because we have patience patience because i feel like this person is getting ready to really reconnect with you have fun with you go out with you but um i'm also getting you you might need some patience too okay have patience seven of cups yeah i feel like there's some kind of um clearing of confusion maybe you have this person on friend zone so there is some confusion here there will be an opportunity to really look into what is really there between you both okay um, that's what I'm getting here. Okay, so I have um, Pisces, Water, Virgo. Okay, let's keep going. Cancer. Let's see what we have for Cancer. Cancer, what is their vibe? What is their vibe? The person on Cancer's mind. Reliable. Stalking. Whoa. Somebody stalking you. Okay. Cancer, I just got that you both are stalking each other. I don't know. Hmm. I, that's what I got. For some of you, of course. Let's see, what is this reliable? Well, this discount, like, stocking. Yeah, they are reliable, okay? I feel like they do, do um, pass the vibe check here because, yeah, they are reliable. I feel like there is something here that still needs to be revealed, but there is some kind of connection there where you both can feel it you know and i feel like maybe this person wants to collaborate team up do something together you know um show you that they are reliable give me more of this stalking yeah they're stalking you i don't know if you've had some kind of disappointment but with this person well it kind of seems like it or they're trying to get over some kind of um disappointment here with the queen of pentacles this I don't know if you're the one that is thinking that there is no hope in this anymore because you already found your your value here you see your value and you feel like maybe that this is a done deal okay but there is still something there that they can feel as well so it's up to you if you still want this because they do okay so we have earth we have um could be a cancer a pisces taurus uh, or just earth sign, water sign here. Okay, so let's keep going. Leo. Let's see what we have for Leos. Leo. Do they pass the vibe check here? Leos. Do they pass the vibe check? Let's see. Give me the... The person on their own Leo's mind, spirit. Twin flame. Ooh. I say no. <laughs> Just kidding. I don't know. Patience. Okay, have some patience, Leo. Or that's probably for a Leo here. Okay, because this is their energy. I forgot. But that just came out of nowhere let's see give me more of this twin flame okay whoever you are thinking about they, they could be a twin flame twin flame is just a label i don't want to add to the twin flame label there is so many things out there of course i've i've stated in the past so okay um just, just a twin flame soulmate it's just a label to me okay whoa wheel of fortune somebody here somebody else got this i think it was an aries things are gonna turn around there is a opportunity knocking on the door or something like that too that's what i'm getting i feel like there is something here yep i feel like you something's gonna switch here there is some i don't know if someone's gonna be attached to you there is still something there between you and this person, okay? Or there is. There's going to be an opportunity here. Could be a Capricorn. 
have patience because the communication is not there's going to be communication why do i keep saying you have patience if this is their vibe i keep saying that for a reason so maybe it's you that needs patience this is your energy kind of uh let's see give me more of this eight of wands some of you probably need that patience here page of wands yeah okay i don't know there's gonna be a message here there's gonna be a conversation but nothing really set in stone this is really up to you if you were willing to take this call um, because i feel like some of you are not gonna want it you've gone through so much with this person and there's still this attachment there for some reason but things are about to turn around here somebody's gonna take a risk that's what i'm getting here why because the cat here never really is never highlighted to me and it is right now so it seems like somebody here is going to surprise you okay there is something here that's turning around for you and this twin flame it could also be someone new because the page of wands does signify someone new and it seems like there's going to be some kind of com conversation, communication coming through, moving forward after some turbulence because something here is turning around. You see how tornado is going and then the wheel is going too. So maybe you're meeting your twin flame because this does signify like a new beginning, a new, um, a new direction here. Okay, so yeah so somebody here is still looking at some past disappointment okay so be so maybe there is still some hope there so we have water we have capricorn sag and fire okay so that is what i have okay sorry about that needed to open the door kobe Let's see what we have for Virgos. The person on Virgo's mind. What do we have for the person on Virgo's mind? Soulmate. Okay, so we have a soulmate here. <laughs> Reliable. Ooh. Okay, you might be... Um, you might be meeting someone new or soulmate, somebody that's reliable. I feel like it's new. I don't know why. But let's see. What is this soulmate? Give me more of this soulmate for Virgos. Oh, it's not new. <laughs> Spirit said, no, it's not. Five of Cups. So there was a disappointment with the soulmate here. But it seems like somebody here is going to be taking action moving forward. They're going to show you that. See. Okay, I don't know if you're going to say something to them or do something. I don't know if you're still mad at them. But they are planning on making a move towards you yeah yeah you're a little bit too guarded i feel like this is you you're not letting them in so so much uh like it, it kind of seems like you were the one that was reliable here but it seems like they want to check your vibe instead <laughs> it kind of seems like that and i feel like you've been through a lot and i don't know but you seem like a little too defensive I feel like this is you, Virgo. I feel like you're a bit mad. There was probably some drama between you both. This person thinks that there is still some some business here to handle. Okay, something here has not closed out completely. There's no closure, no nothing. I feel like it could be also them that they are don't feel this from you. Like there is still something there. Mhm. Mm so um, that is what I have here. This person could be feeling that you're trying to free yourself from them too, for some reason. Yeah, that's what I'm getting. So I have fire, I have air, I have, uh, could be a Leo, a Sag, any fire sign or water. Okay, so let's keep going. Let's 
Let's see what we have for Libras. The person on Libra's mind. The person on Libra's mind. The person on Libra's mind. Manipulative. Oof. Mm-mm. Inconsistent. Oh, no. They don't pass the vibe check. Mm-mm. Well, I don't know about you, but <laughs> they told to me. Nope, nope, nope. Give me more of this manipulator. Let's see. On Libra's mind. <gasps> Sorry if you can hear that. Okay. This person really... They... They don't reveal much about themselves, okay? Um, and you can probably feel it, Libra. Yeah, and because they didn't reveal anything, the real them or something that they had to say or something, or maybe it did come out. There was some kind of enlightenment. Like you probably thought, yeah, this, this person is manipulative. And something came crumbled down. I, I, I want to say shit hit the fan for some reason. I don't know. Well, of course, because of the tower. But I usually don't say that. You may move that inconsistent. Yeah. Knight of Pentacles. They were very, very slow to commit. Okay, what's this? Very slow to commit. And it kind of seems like now they want to work on things. Now that you're walking away. It seems like you're the one that is walking away. Mm-hmm. Let's see. Yeah, it seems that way. But this person is very slow to even fix the situation here between you both. Something here is not being said, okay? But it's going to come out. And I feel like it's going to come out pretty soon, okay? That they were kind of manipulating a situation. And I feel like... You're going to want to walk away or this person's going to be very inconsistent or you're going to realize why they were very inconsistent. I feel for some reason, I do see that they are kind of reaching out while you walk away. I feel like this is you for some reason. Okay, that is what I'm getting here. King of Cups, they might not even be revealing that they have feelings for you. And that is what is they're they're not um how do i say emotionally mature okay that is what i'm getting here okay so i do see a taurus a water sign a scorpio could be um what is it cancer pisces taurus or scorpio okay so that is what i have Scorpio, what is the person on Scorpio's mind? What is their vibe here? Deceptive. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. They don't pass the vibe check. Adjustable and flexible. Okay. Okay, are they are they being deceptive because they don't want to be they don't want to adapt to something here? Ace of Pentacles, or are they making you think that there is going to be a proposal or something really good? Okay, be careful if this is someone new. What? They're being deceptive. It seems as if, I don't know why, it could be someone new for some of you. Or it could be that they're being deceptive about their feelings, about their where they want to go. Where they want to take this um, connection. Give me more of this adjustable and flexible. It's kind of weird card. What is this adjustable and flexible? Oh, 
okay there could be some drama here okay there could be somebody here that was okay there could have been some drama okay they were very deceptive before but i feel like there's a new beginning here um, somebody here wants to talk things out maybe wants to um work things out here we have the three of pentacles collaborate come together maybe there was some drama there maybe there was something here that was said without really thinking about it putting too much thought about it so they're kind of coming up with a plan or maybe wanting to talk things out and they are being a lot more um flexible here okay something might have came out that was not very i feel like maybe somebody here said something without even th um, thinking about it okay there could have been some drama between you both but They, something could have happened also at work. I don't always relate that to work, but, you know, it could happen. The Ace of Pentacles with the Two of Cups. I feel like they're being deceptive about, you know, being a very flexible, wanting to work things out and having something new. Okay, so just be careful. Let's see what's at the bottom. Nine of Cups. See, to it kind of seems like somebody here could be selfish. This is at the bottom of the deck, so it kind of seems like they're coming off selfish. Yeah, but they're kind of like, yeah, they're coming off as selfish. Okay, I don't know if they're being deceptive to you, so you can work things out with them. But just be careful. Use your intuition. Because this is at the, at the bottom of the deck. It kind of seems like it's an issue. You know. So somebody being selfish. Okay. So we do have water. We have um, earth. There is going to be an opportunity for a new beginning. But just use your intuition here. Okay. Um, use discernment. So I did have Pisces. Earth. What was it? Air. Um, earth. What else? Oops. Forgot. I forgot already. Oh, yeah. Earth and water. Okay. So it could be any of those. It's up to you if they pass a the vibe check or nothing. Or, okay. Or not. Sagittarius. Give me Sagittarius. Sagittarius. The person on their mind. What is their vibe? person on their mind the person on their mind emotional vampire mm -mm. twin flame oh love the bottom of the deck so there could be there could be love but somebody here is an emotional vampire you don't want that believe me you don't want that even though if they're a twin flame or not you don't want it so to me they don't especially with the twin flame here sorry but no um it, it's up to you okay oh, to each his own <laughs> five of pentacles here yeah somebody here is being left out in the cold or just lack lack that this is never going to work out the lack of mentality could be you know this is never going to work out um emotional vampire mm. just be careful you don't want emotional vampire trust me king of swords and the reason why is because they could be coming off a little too cold too distant yeah, and that can really get to you. Give me more of this Twin Flame. Twin Flame is just a label, okay? I have my own beliefs on it, but it doesn't mean that you have to be with your Twin Flame. That's my belief, though. It's really up to you. Eight of Swords here. So it, it kind of seems like it's them that they are stuck in their thoughts about maybe a message here them stuck on in their thoughts oh they want to start all over they want to figure out how they can talk to you about starting all over i get talking here because of that bird that's being highlighted kind of seems like they're wanting to talk i don't know if you've been just trying to stay 
in your own lane here or you've cut them off or you cut them off because they were being emotional vampire here but there was a lack of insecurity that this is, wasn't gonna work out somebody was too much in their head like analyzing the situation making a logical decision like a logical how do i say without putting their emotion in it okay i don't know if and that's probably why you felt emotional uh, like there were emotional vampire or something like that because they were cold not putting their heart in it but this person has been thinking about um starting all over reigniting something here with the queen of cups yeah do some self-care self-love okay put yourself first because this being at the bottom of the deck it kind of seems like you kind of put them first before you okay so really do some self-care self-love never do not um give in so much don't give so much match their energy if you can okay uh, i know a lot of people say no they should be giving more they shouldn't be matching your energy well no sometimes you have to start somewhere <laughs> i i believe okay so we have an aquarius here could be a cancer earth air fire okay so that's what i have there let's keep going capricorn 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 what is on capricorn's person's mind no the person on their mind sorry <laughs> what is the person on their mind what is their vibe there here vindictive Oof. Mm -mm. self-centered wow i have good cards in here too okay just so you know they could be a freeloader too for some of you okay so they do not pass the vibe check okay so stay clear let's see what is this vindictive someone's trying to be vindictive they're only thinking about themselves mm -mm. Ooh, five of wands yep indeed so there could be a lot of like petty arguments or just a lot of arguments between you both yeah petty arguments somebody yeah petty arguments that lead to heartbreak there could also be other people getting in the way there could have been some like a third influence i'm not saying like a third party could be but could be like a third influence here and um they're trying to they're being vindictive mm -mm stay clear from this person stay away stay away oh yeah this is somebody that loves to be loved but is not there to stay okay they only think of themselves oh you might cut them off mm -hmm. because of their inconsistency because of how much they're self-centered or they come off that way because they're very inconsistent and there could be other things here and because you cut them off they are they could be heartbroken because of that because of everything that piled up uh, between you both okay so they're kind of like been trying to get revenge there is something here that maybe did not come out yet or hasn't came out but you might even find out more stuff here this being at the bottom of the deck so just be careful with this person i don't know who this is for use your your use discernment okay we have air we have fire we have libra and sag okay let's keep going Aquarius, what do we have? Aquarius, with the person on Aquarius's mind. The person on Aquarius's mind. Maturity. Ooh. Self-reflective. Wow, this person passes the vibe check. I feel. 
okay they could be testing your boundaries aquarius so just know that okay so have good healthy boundaries is needed okay because no matter how mature they are no matter how much they've reflected they still might test you okay so let's see what is this maturity maturity so this person is actually willing to start i don't know if this is someone new okay this person does not want to go a different direction i don't know if this is someone new but or you could be avoiding this because i feel like maybe this is you trying to avoid them yeah somebody here is trying to avoid this person hmm i don't know if you are thinking about going a different direction jumping into another relationship because the seven of swords does kind of um give this feeling of like leaving not being really you probably are doing some self there's some self-sabotage here or if you're you're wanting to really jump into another relationship leaving something behind without even like getting closure from it and you're thinking about a different direction for some reason but this is their check this person is going to message you and you're going to be thinking about it because you're avoiding a different situation i feel like this is you and this is them they're going to come in and message you. I don't know who. Four of Swords at the bottom. So somebody here has been doing some self-reflective. They've been reviewing the situation. Could be you too thinking about it. But it's, yeah, it's someone you told you. Knight of Cups. This person will be mature and they're going to want something good with you. Yes, they pass the vibe check if you ask me. The Knight of Cups with the Two of Cups. This is love. This person will be testing your boundaries, like I said. So don't do some self-sabotaging, okay? If you're thinking about doing something um, or avoiding a situation to get into something new, do some self-reflection or don't self-sabotage yourself. Go be willing to take this new opportunity, for some reason there is someone coming in but you're i don't know why i feel like this is you okay um yeah either this person did some thinking they're coming off very mature but for some reason you have to do some um really some dig deep because this person is going to want something good I don't know if you're going to do some self-sabotaging here. I don't know. I feel like it was, it's you. You're trying to avoid something. Going a different direction. But whoever is coming in is going to be mature. Is going to want to talk things out. Start new. You know. Um, yeah. I don't know who this is. It kind of feels new. See. It, it's someone new it could be a new air sign but that is what is a challenge here to test this out this new this new direction that you're trying to avoid okay whoever is coming in if this is someone new that came in already um they they're they are going to be mature they've already done the whole self-reflecting and this person is going to like kind of woo you mm-hmm so be careful on what kind of um, some self-sabotaging, what kind of thoughts too, okay? I don't know why I'm getting that, okay? So you tell me, I don't know, we have water, we have air, we have fire there. So to me, they pass the vibe check. Okay, let's do Pisces. What do we have for 
Pisces, Pisces. The person on Pisces is mind. What is person on Pisces mind? What is your vibe? Oh, we have two. Inconsistent and only wants SEX. Mm -mm. Okay. Freeloader. Oof. No. Okay. Um this person seems a bit selfish, Pisces. So just be careful. Have some um, boundaries, healthy boundaries. Okay. Well, it's really up to you what you want, of course. But I don't know about this vibe. I does not check out for me. I don't feel. I don't feel like it does for you either. Okay. So there is some inconsistencies. Maybe some outside influences too. It could also be like a inner conflict within themselves about you like not knowing see inner conflict it is because i feel like this person does really like has that sweet vibe but there is some inner conflict there i feel give me more of this only wants sex they don't know about you know you know really giving to the situation and you probably are you're very very giving very sweet very loving way more of this only wants sex and that's what they love about you but that's what really they fight themselves because of this see they're gonna be very slow to commit but this person when they commit they commit for good okay so let's see so they're going to be pulled from two different places. Like I said, it's this inner conflict, not knowing which direction to head, not knowing what they really want, not knowing if they really do want to give more than just the, you know, SEX. So just be careful. Okay. Mm. Yeah. This kind of seems like it's somebody from your past. Okay. Someone here is avoiding something real you probably have gone through a lot already with this person i don't know why but someone here is also escaping um avoiding ending a situation here yeah it could be you but there is you know after the ten of swords is a new beginning so maybe this new beginning is kind of a struggle for them to actually decide if they do want a new beginning with you or not okay so we do have air there we have cancer taurus fire pisces it could be another pisces okay but i don't like the freeloader so keep your money in your pockets <laughs> in your purse okay that is what i have thank you so much and take care of you bye